Hello people, Eastern Ontario. Just a little update on the uh, wind turbine. 12 mile an hour wind. And 5 amps. Goes up to 10. But I just wanted to say that when my turbine or whatever is uh, recharging, all my battery bank down there, as you can see, 10 batteries, US 2006 volts. Uh, the turbine is producing power, but this power is always on the load. Always, always on the load. I run my whole house with these batteries, so these two inverters, see this wire, it goes all the way to the fridge and the freezer. Lights are in the kitchen. What else is on? got the TV on, this light is on, the other light is on, this light is on. So, and as you can see, if I flick off this, oh, everything's turned off in this, see? So, I just turn the inverter back on, and everything goes back on. Even the TV, there she goes. So, all of my amps, 8 mile an hour wind, all of my amps are under load. So if anybody is wondering, uh, there's no, uh, there's no bullshit here. It's always on the load. I run my whole house with these batteries, so she's still uh, supplying some good, uh, some good amps for those batteries. She keeps my char, my battery charged up. So yeah, that's what I wanted to say. It is always on the load, all the time. Even this house here, uh, even the light here, see? If I go like this, oh, that's it. Fridge, everything turned off. Oh, there she goes. So, everything is under load. Let's see if it makes a difference. Shut it down. Well, it doesn't make that much of a difference, eh? There you go. That's all I had to say. Come on, amps, go up, go up, go up! <laughs> there they go. Oh, 9.3 miles an hour. Okay, there's my map. Look at those amps, baby! So 15 miles an hour, we're getting 16, 14 amps. And like I say, everything's under load here, man. She's not free spinning at all. As you can see, if I flick this switch right here on the uh, inverter, my old house is, is on the on my own grid, so we had spikes of 18 amps. There's my 18 miles an hour wind. Oh, there it goes up. 14. And I'm running a 12 volt system here. As you can see, fully charged. Better than better. The whole house is running on these batteries. Uh, these two inverters. And oh, look at that, eh? 14 mile an hour wind, mile per hour wind, so I'm getting good amps, especially when everything's under load, I'm still getting great amps, not that bad, oh, something just turned on because, oh, there she goes. <laughs> So, uh, I know I see these uh, other wind turbines, and, and I think uh, this one's producing pretty, pretty good amps. There's only a 13 mile an hour wind here, so we don't get uh, 50 miles an hour wind here. Never saw it.
I saw 40 once, 37. But, uh, eh, she's going down now. So it's still my grid, you know, a little uh, grid die there, 500 watts for the house. Turbine, three phase, rectifier, disconnect box, charge controller. These are uh, solar power or uh, solar arrays, solar panels, whatever you want to call them. <laughs> My two inverters. They're made by Zantrax or PureSyn. PureSyn, PureSyn Wave or whatever. One of the little chargers, the bigger charger if ever I need it. And like I say underneath now here I've got uh, 10 US 2000. And with those 10 batteries, they're 6 volt series parallel. Uh, I supply my own house. Okay. Just wanted to show you that I'm still getting good amps and uh, the system is still running pretty damn good. See you later.